Good morning. Good morning. Welcome back to our YouTube channel. Welcome back to our YouTube channel. Thank you for stopping by. I really do appreciate you. Thank you so much. I appreciate you. Please, if you haven't subscribed, could you please kindly click the right subscribe button? If you have subscribed, Gloria Chizzy O is saying thank you. Thank you so much. I appreciate you. So this morning I had on this bat. I had this bat and I remember that oh I have not shared it with um my family and friends on YouTube. And I know how important and spiritually powerful this bat is. This is I don't know if you can see this is rosemary. This is what it looks like, rosemary. Rosemary is um very powerful spiritual plant herb spice sorry it's a very powerful spiritual spice now rosemary does two things rosemary lets out and then draw in how do you make it um a letting out herb alone it depends on how you charge it and the things you add to it and how do you make it a drawing and blessing and herbs it depends on how you charge it and the things you add to it so today, all you'll be needing for this wonderful bath like I had this morning, I feel spiritually refreshed, <laughs> is, actually there is a reason why I had it this morning, but let's not go there. All you need is your rosemary, um, three cinnamon sticks, and some bay leaves. Now, you can have this bath for three days, for three days, seven days, depending on what you how or what or you want to have the reason why you're having the bath. You understand? Like myself, I am only having it this morning. I call it the spiritual revitalizer. Nature is God's blessings to mankind. But if you find yourself that um things are not moving, things are just stagnant spiritual spouse meeting in the dream eating in the dream near success syndrome um promise and fail now you need just the rosemary bay leaf and three sticks of cinnamon then if you want to have the baths for blessing drawing and all that now the good thing is everyone needs these baths whether you feel like things are moving for you the way you want or not but if you want to use it to, for drawing sweetness, goodness, and all that, get rosemary, your three cinnamon stick, and some bay leaf, boil it. Then when it is um when it's boiled, now it's always advisable that you if you're using it for um I don't know how to put it, it's always advisable that you use it as after rinse. So you make sure that the pot you are using to boil it is a little bit big for you to just use it to rinse yourself and allow it to dry on you. So when you boil this mixture, then you can go ahead and add some cinnamon powder if you have, some sugar if you have, sea salt if you have. Even the first method, you need sea, uh, you need salt. If you have sea salt, it's fine. If you have salt, it's good. Like myself, I use sea salt. Now, before we proceed further on this video, there is um, two other videos I would want you to also use and practice in the comment section. Check the comment section. These videos will be there. They are very powerful. They will help you by God's grace, open your way, bring blessings, and remove what needs to be removed out of your life by the grace of God. Check the comment section. So also, if you need the rosemary, cinnamon, all the items mentioned, you can WhatsApp me. My number will be in the comment section. So like I said, if you're using it for sweetening, blessing, um, goodness, and all that, when you are done boiling these mixtures, put it down, allow it to get cold, sieve it, and all that, pour it into a bucket, then you add some sugar, and um, sugar, cinnamon, honey, if you have. Now, that reminds me, a couple of persons have been coming to WhatsApp to ask me about the testimony I shared on the community two days ago about one of us that did some things on the channel and she got her work permit. 
I will be uploading that video today by the grace of God because I promised um, I promised us that I'll be making a video out of it so that others we will all learn. So check today by God's grace, God willing, or rather the next video that will be coming up should be on that so that we also learn and apply it. So when you mix this mixture with your honey and all that, all you need to do is pour it on yourself, speaking, uh, rather before you pour it, speak favor, speak blessing, good things into it. Then pour it on yourself and allow it to dry on you. Do not store well dry. Then you can go ahead and apply your cream or whatever you understand. This can also be used without adding sugar and um, honey. You can use this mixture as a cleansing bath also. It's very powerful. I tell you, by the time you do this for three days, seven days, you will see a remarkable change in your life by the grace of God. By God's grace, things begin to will begin to work for you, God willing. So give this um, mixture a try, and I am sure you will not regret trying it. Thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate you. It's none other person but Gloria Cheesy. Oh, thank you.